exactly 9.30 a.m. I took a job I normally wouldn't take. I almost rushed out to grab it. Oh no, somebody's coming in the elevator. Let's go, buddy, come on in. Let me talk to the camera. So um, I took this order. It's nine bucks for four miles, and I only took it because I'm concerned that it might be super slow this early in the day. Uh, it's only for uh, two items. Is this literally an order for two chicken biscuits? All right, let's get it. It took us a second to get down here, but that's good. You can see there's nobody in front. Never forget that breakfast Chick-fil-A is always easy to pick up, so we're here. We're just stuck at the light. Alright, so for the first time ever, there's nobody in this Chick-fil-A complex. I can turn my back on the camera for one second. I got Giselle. Let's see. Alright, easy enough. Nine bucks and we're on the road very early. It's it's 9.39. Uber order coming in. It's too small. That goes in the box. Uh, we're definitely turning off Uber. We got to go all the way to La Cienega. I would like to put the pedal to the middle. This is a drop off on Melrose Place. And my guess is we're going to park the vehicle out front, not tie it up, and run up and down one flight of stairs. If I understand the directions. There you go. How you doing? Hi. Hi. All right. Chick fil A. Thank Enjoy, you. thank you. Have a great day. You too. So we always love it when the directions are that you're going up and that they just show up right there at the entrance. That's nice. Uh, maybe it took a bunch of time sometimes. I don't, think that, I don't think that order was actually late. Okay, one order in the books, nine bucks. And we did leave the house at 9.30 exactly, right? At right, 9.51. That was a lot of legwork. It was a four-mile order, but 21 minutes, nine bucks. Good morning. Uh-oh, what's that? $3.00. No. I forgot to check my tire pressure when I left this morning, so I saw this pole here. I figured I could lean up against it really quick and do a quick tire pressure check. It's actually fine. I'm very happy. It's sitting at um, 51. I, I put it for 54. You lose a little bit when you change it, so fi low 50s is where I want it. We're getting murdered with this extended weight right now. It's 10.22. Uh, it's We've been on the road since 9.30 and only did that one $9 order, so orange time. Let's eat, we got two little minis. Maybe this could be the thumbnail. This is a one mile distance delivery for a bottle of liquor, we're gonna do it. And see you next time, bro. All right, easy enough. Hi, it's your Uber driver. I am on my way with your liquor delivery. I just wanted to ask you to have your ID ready. I will need to scan it to release the liquor. Thank you. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's this big building on the corner. Oh yeah, there it is. How dumb is that to have the numbers spelled out instead of having the numbers? Very quick look at this. Uh, guys, don't, don't do this. This fucking building, look at this, terrible. Uh, so it looks like we're tying up and we're going in on this liquor order. Oh, oh perfect. Oh, and it's air conditioned in here. Nice. All right, we're going at 320, it looks like. Oh, we got the elevator on our side. Let's make it smooth. Is it? Oh, good. I'll take care of it. I appreciate it. You got, you got me this way. Yeah. Are you ready? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I, I should, I, it is here, there is a 320 here, you're yeah, saying, yeah, okay. Yeah. How you doing? You're not Joe, are you? I am. Oh, here, let me get that ID from you, buddy. <laughs> Just a bottle of soda, buddy, here we go. Thanks, buddy. Thanks so much. Hey, my pleasure, enjoy. You got it. We got it done. All right, scooter's okay. We're not getting any orders, and I just feel like I'm super hungry, so I haven't had a fast food breakfast in a while, and Wendy's looks like they're empty, so let's get it. And then as I walk in there, I got like a valid Chick-fil-A order. We're gonna skip the breakfast. Less diabetes for us, more money. Let's go, 2.4 miles, $7.75. Hey guys, I have an Edison B. 
No problem. A minute, that was like 10 seconds. Thank you. Of course, of course. Boom. Thank you. See you next time. Oh, they're getting serious about swiping. I guess they got people coming up to the window and just stealing shit. Uh, we're here, and I already don't like the looks of this place. Yeah, I've been here before. This, I don't think we're going in. Your call has been pulled. Pretty good idea, I'm just gonna end up leaving the food like right here. All right, I just took a picture, sent it to him. He's not contacting anything, but we're at the right place. We're good. It's been really slow, but I think uh, Fat Sal's has got the medicine for us. $15 for four miles, uh, but the drop-offs, I'm not going to Little Armenia, damn it. Can I get also uh, an additional small fry with that? Man, we're super slow. Now they're trying to tempt us with a 17 mile order, forget it. We're getting killed, we've been sitting here forever. This is a two mile delivery and it's into the hills. But for nine bucks, I think we're just gonna do it. This is actually pretty easy to find drop off. Leave it door by mailbox. Is okay, we got you. Just a little bit of traffic coming down Highland, just bumper to bumper all the way. That's why we're on the sidewalk. We gotta decide if we want to take this, uh, yeah, $10 Chick fil A three miles. Hi guys, I have two. I have Jake A for Uber, and I also have Mona A for DoorDash. Right now, we don't have it ready. We'll call it out when it's ready. Thank you. Hi guys, I got Mona A. I'll swipe that for you. And I also have, just you know, for Uber, I have um, I have Jake A as well. Let's talk to you right now. All right, man. Nice to meet you. Be safe out there on that thing. Alrighty, guys. This is a pretty long ride, but it's a double. We're gonna do the Uber first and the DoorDash second. The DoorDash is really far away. So we'll do the Uber order first. It's only like a half mile from here. Then we'll turn off Uber and we'll fucking hightail it, high speed it on the DoorDash run. All right, we got visual on the address. Hopefully this will be easy and then we can shoot down to Beverly for the long part of the order. Is there a code here? Yes, can't see without my glasses though. So I don't mean to be alarmist, but we're having a very slow day. We've been out here for more than two and a half hours. I don't think we've even made 40 bucks after we close these out but it is what it is i've made comebacks before apartment 204 now this is the one with the drink all right we're killing uber so we can go faster <laughs> Uh, we got the light. We were here yesterday on this liquor order. I think we didn't go in. I think we're going in on this one though. Two zero two seven four six. All right, we're five minutes late on this order. No big deal. Oh my god. Oh, I need. Oh, I have the code. Okay, she gave me the code. All right, boom. Okay, so yeah, technically we're five minutes late on this. You're allowed to be ten minutes. But I think we will not be 10 minutes late. Oh my god, 235, 270, we gotta go to 206. We gotta get on a scooter, fuck. I got fucking turned around and now we're in the parking garage trying to figure out how to get out of here. I don't think it should be too hard, but fuck, will this open here? Uh, we were trapped in here for a long time. I had to ask a maid 
how to get out of here, but we did it. Having a rough day, but at least it's beautiful out. So it's 12.30, we are at, man, these roads are terrible. We're at 50 bucks for the first three hours. We're having a bad opening shift. Uh, we're not doing Jack in the Box, forget about that. We've been getting a lot of these today. We never do Jack in the Box. All right, we had to wait a long time for this good one. 1.8 miles, $8, fat sales, let's go. Can't believe it's like 80 degrees out. I like this one because it says you have to leave it at the entrance, so you got like these types of orders all day. That one paid $9.90 instead of $8. That's always a nice little, little extra, you can't complain. So it's $12.50. We definitely have enough juice for a couple more good runs before we switch the scooter out. Looks like we got another good one from Fat Sal's. 2.2 miles, eight and a quarter. Thank you, Fat Sal's. We're seven minutes early, so we're gonna pull off a short sit down. Now, John A. DoorDash. All right, so we're turning off Uber. We're going high speed on this run, and then we're probably going to switch the scooters out after this. We got it, we got it. Hello, John speaking. Hey John, it's your DoorDash. I'm here at the entrance. I just don't have a code for you or anything. I got you, okay. I'll, I'll walk up and get it. Cool, thanks. Hey John. Here you go, man. Enjoy. Thank you. Thank you. you right, so that paid out $9.25 instead of $8.25. I almost tried to give the customer the order without the drink. I can't believe I did that. He was like, is there a drink? And I was like, oh shit, there is, I'm sorry. Um, I'm sure some drivers <laughs> try to steal drinks, right? Okay, we're going home now to switch the scooters out and have a tea and nicotine break. We deserve it after this terrible shift. Thanks, buddy. Hi, how are you? Okay, we'll see you next time. Yeah. Just nicotine, we're just smoking the nicotine. a little bit of tea it's good it's barely even a break we're going right back out one more nicotine hit all right let's go it's exactly 1 30 you know we're trying to do these six hours so ideally we work until 3 30 we could work longer I and mean, we had a very bad first four hours so We'll put at least two more hours in and figure it out from there. We made it all the way down to the Target Center without an order, and now we got this $5, 50 cent, one mile Otis tie. We definitely are taking it. Going to war with these motherfuckers. All right, they pinged me, so it's ready. I'm bringing in food. Can I slide in with you? Thank you. Alright, 104. Oh, I still got 
Hát jó délet. After a long wait, we got a good one, $8.25, Mendocino Farms for a half a mile. We're sitting right next to it. Wow, we were just about to walk in there to check on the DoorDash that we have here at Mendo, and we got a, another Mendo from Uber, which very well could be ready. Uber runs ahead of DoorDash. All right, so now we're going in for two. Three, yeah, and I have Aaron for DoorDash. You're the best, thank you. Thought I like that, two small orders going in a box. They're toppers. A double topper is hard to get. Okay, so DoorDash first. It's over near uh, Kaiser, but it says not Kaiser, so he's gonna meet us on the street. Let's get it done. All right, this is, it said Common Grounds. I didn't realize it meant that's a coffee shop. All right, so here we go. Your destination is on the left. Hey there, it's your driver. I'm pretty sure I'm like right out front where you wanna meet me. Um, you know, I'm right on this long sidewalk by, uh, by the hospital where it says common grounds everywhere, but I can't see an entrance to it. How you doing, man? Thank you. Take it easy. Is that it? That's, that's, yeah, that is it. I thought there should have been a drink with it or something? Yeah, like a, that's fine. Oh yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, that's all they gave me. That's fine. Yeah, it's for another person. Sorry. Oh, no, it's, it's missing. I don't know. I mean, that's bullshit. I didn't like it. was too late. It was closed. Can't take this McDonald's because we got to finish, finish this other one. I feel genuinely bad that that guy's order was missing something. But Mendocino, you know, you, I've never, you never check their orders or anything. But regardless, I like the way he handled it because the second he saw it wasn't there, and I started, like, apologizing and maybe giving, like, a little speech. He's like, you know, he doesn't want to fight it. He knows it's over from there. The food's not here. You can't talk me into it. I'm not going to go back and get it or why get upset. You know, it's not my fucking fault. All right, we're meeting this customer right here. My dog poops on this lawn like every day. This is part of my four corner route. We got a Hollywood sushi for six bucks, 1.2 miles. Let's go. Hi guys, I got a KDH. Oh, beautiful, oh, there's no more barrier, oh, okay. No. Thank you. Thank you. See you. Oh, that's funny, they got rid of the COVID barrier. <laughs> We got it, we got it. We overshot it for sure. 1300, that's always got to be the corner unit, right? So I guess that's, yeah, 1300. Here we go. I'm not sure what if we're tying up here or what. Not the number one on the right. We like those directions. Boom. Always clearly read the note before you tie up because if I would have realized this was unit number one, first one on the right, I could have saved the tie up time and the untying time. It's slow, but I think we're above 100 bucks for the exact first five hours. It's 2.30, we have one more hour to go. Maybe we can have a day saving hour. Maybe we can have like a $30 hour. You never know what can happen, but one more hour left. I'm fucking beat, man. I'm tired at this point of the day. Oh, wow. Thanks. Do I want to do a seven and a half mile, $9.50 fat sales? No, thank you. All right, I'm sitting here with Jason. Uh, this would be a day saver. Listen, I could do it. It's 4.3 miles for $15.50. But like I said earlier, I'm not going to like little Armenia. That's just way too far. I thought we had a good one here, but it's McDonald's for four dollars fifty cents. It's against my religion to look at any order under five bucks. No way, I can't go there. All about the bread coming in. Six? Yep, exactly. Right? Is that what it was? It's similar, but not it was, the same. It was twenty-five cents more. 
It might be the same one. I had that happen yesterday. Well, I'm not taking it because this is all the way order. down to the fucking. Yeah, this is all the way down to Park La Brea for six seventy five. I think that's the same order, dude. I would do it. Alrighty, guys. It's almost three p.m. Out of desperation, we're taking a six dollar. Get the fuck out. Taking my glasses. <laughs> we're taking a six dollar twenty five cent Chick Fil A order. I guess we have nothing else to do. Oh, thank God, man. This place is packed, but I did not want to have to wait. Got lucky. This is a leave with security at the front desk order. Hi guys, it says uh, for Bray High, yeah. it leave with security at front desk. Thank you very much. Thank Enjoy. You. Thank you. All right, looks like we got a $7.50.9 mile McDonald's. Let's go. Is this the regular McDonald's? No, it's the one on Hollywood Boulevard. That's no problem. We know where it is. This is the McDonald's that I go to when I want to go crazy and eat McDonald's. Hey, guys. We got 299 for DoorDash. The last three numbers are 299. All right, this is one of the biggest McDonald's orders I've ever seen. It feels like it's got a lot of drinks, a lot of potential for spillage, so let's try to pack it nice. All right, we packed it nice. We're good to go. Get out of the way, zombies. Look at this, fucking zombies. The last thing they did before zombification was make a baby, and they're stuck in perpetual motion of, of moving the stroller. This guy, last thing he did was work the garbage patrol, and then he died and became a zombie, and that's all they do now. You hand them the order. They added the following instructions. Hand out on uh, I think this is going to be an easy one. Hello. Hey, it's your DoorDash. I'm here. Um, I'm trying to get your front gate open. This thing is kind of like rusted shut for my. I can't. I'm here. I'm just having trouble getting in. I'll come down. Thank you. I'll come down. Thanks. This might be bottom heavy, so I'd be careful with this. Okay, great. I'll, I'll get it. Yeah, thank you. Enjoy. Great, thanks. That was a good one. That paid $9.50 instead of the $7.50 promised payout. So that helps a little bit. I think right now it's like $3.15 or $3.20. Yeah, it's $3.21. We really like to get one more order in this last 10 minutes. I think we're just a little bit above 100 now. We're sitting down north of our usual spot. Five minutes left on the shift. We're really trying to squeeze in Walmart order. It was a terrible day. We'd like to salvage it with like some miracle $15 order at the last second, but I want to stick with working six hours, you know, partly so I don't burn myself out. You know, there's always tomorrow, even though I am taking tomorrow off. So let's just sit here and chill and maybe we'll get another order. That was a desperate last few minutes trying to get, trying to get order there, sitting there on fucking La Brea, like a slave in the heat. But we ended up going to uh, Dos Burritos and pit, we're picking up our favorite burrito and that's it. We did like 112 or 115 for about, for exactly six hours. So basically terrible, but we got it done. We're taking tomorrow off and the day after that, we'll be right back to it. Guys, I appreciate you finding the video. Please subscribe to the channel, like the video, ask comments, questions, help me push it, push the algorithm. And I appreciate your support. Thanks guys. Thanks guys, see you next time. Last one going in for me.